All right, now we're back over at the monitor. We're going to reinstall the power supply board and test the monitor out. Um, first thing that you need to do is uh, reconnect the small cable coming off the power supply board to the small plug on the video controller card. I'll just plug right in. And you can set the board in place. And we'll put our screws back in. our flat panel and set it down. Need to feed the uh, backlight cables back through the two holes and then they will plug into the little sockets. Now there is a blue and black and a pink and white it does not matter which one of the two, of the two sockets each one plugs into. Um, both sockets have the same amount of power coming out. Um, so you just plug one in and then plug the other one in. And then we'll set the power supply in place. The next thing to connect up is the display cable. And it's going to plug right back into... the slot that it came out of. And then the last thing to plug in is this front display cable. Pull out a little bit of a slack. And then it's going to plug in place and use a small screwdriver to make sure that it's well seated down inside of its slot. All right, now we need to re uh, replace the shield that covered the backlight plugs. I should going to slide in place. Now we get our case cover. It snaps back into place. Now we can plug in our power cord and test our monitor and there you see we have a working monitor waiting for an input signal another one saved from the trash pile